I really want to start with a sincere thank you. I laughed my ass off last night, and I just want to thank you. Um, it was great. Uh, You're welcome. Um, so I, I'm so curious. What do you think fans of Jackass would be surprised to learn about the actual making of a Jackass movie? The smell. <laughs> it's, it's horrendous. It's horrendous. Very yeah. consistent, bad smells of... Dave's pooping constantly. Just everything. There's so much weird odors all the time. I'm not even joking. <laughs> no, I, I see it on screen. I, I There's a lot of shit flying around. It is, you know... <laughs> um, Very so, real. Uh, Jeff seems to be willing to film literally anything and put you guys through the ringer. Is there a safe word that you are given to actually tell Jeff this? I, I really need to be left alone. It's it's always been Oklahoma. He yeah. started it, but it doesn't do any good. Never Je- Jeff's specialty is making people do things that they're not comfortable doing. Yeah. Once he learns that, and if you do a safety word, that just means you're going to have to do it even more. Yeah, I'm terrified of ice cream. It's like if someone's really upset and you tell them to relax, it has the exact opposite effect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, the other thing is, like, I, I, I'm curious what it's like when you're actually filming because you, like, when you're home, is your blood pressure high just because you know that at any moment Jeff could walk through the door and fuck with you? Or is it sort of like you know when you're home you might be safe? There is no safe place anymore. Yeah, when something starts to seem weird, and you're, even if you're in the safety of your own home, you just you start to think, wait a second. Yeah, what's really going on? Is, yeah. The booze and cheeseburgers got my blood pressure high. <laughs> he blames it all on the booze and cheeseburgers, not Jeff. <laughs> uh, for all four of you, um, what is the most scared you've actually been? Uh, what was the most scared you've been when you were standing on the set of this movie? Knoxville's bull scene. Yeah, yeah, yeah it looks like he died. Yeah, I thought he yeah. died. That was, that was a tough, tough day. Yeah, really tough. That was very scary. We were supposed yeah. to film a whole, like three more bits that day. That was the first and thing in the it. morning. That was it. We're done. We stopped filming after that for like a couple weeks, I think. Yeah, it was right before Christmas. Yeah, right before Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> but it looks rad. <laughs> yeah. It turned out well. Oh, He's yeah. okay uh, for the most part. <laughs> I, I was uh, jaw on ground. Um, Eric, anything you want to uh, add? Yeah, those were, those were really good ones. The bull one for me as well, like my heart almost stopped. Like just to see it, like if if when you see the film, you know how many times he flipped around, it didn't look real in a sense. So it was very overwhelming. Even when he was getting shot at the cannon, I was like, I hope it doesn't backfire. Like, you know, there, there is so much that you're just going, ooh, how does it go? So obviously Spike Jones is involved in this uh, production, um, but I noticed that no one really fucks with Spike. Is there an unwritten rule on set that like he cannot be messed with? No, there's not. Nah. We, we kick him in the nuts every now and then. Yeah, he gets nut shots. <laughs> he, he's not afraid either. He'll take any. He'll do anything. He usually instigates it. Yeah, he likes it. Yeah, he'll he'll kick you first, and you're like, all right, well. <laughs> and then he'll say harder, harder, and you you feel a little bad because he's so you know, he's a big time dude. Just I don't know, but got to do it. There's no, uh, no, there's no safe person or no. safe place when you're on a set of Jackass ever since the beginning. Like, if yeah. you're there, if you've signed a release, it's on. You don't know what's going to happen. Uh, needless to say, as a fan of Jackass, I was, I'm so happy you did it, but it's been 10 years. Do you actually think, like, this could be the beginning of more? Or do you, like, maybe Jackass the next generation? Like, or do you think this is kind of, this might be it? I feel like we're exactly halfway in our progression, which means we've got what twenty-two more years. Twenty-two to go? more years, yep. and, then, and and we'll always be involved. It'll always yeah. be the OG crew and last man standing kind of thing. We, it, we could be doing Jackass for another twenty-two years, for another thirty years. Who knows? Like we're, we keep writing ideas, and we keep being able to. If we can't move our bodies, we'll write ideas that involve us not moving our bodies. Like whatever. I'll be right there behind Eric the whole way. <laughs> the day that our uh, the. TV show, the first episode aired was the day that Eric was born. Yeah, conceived. Mm-hmm. Born. Oh, yeah. born. born. That's crazy. Yeah. yeah. I had no idea. That's crazy. Listen, I got, I got a wrap. I'm just going to say, and I really mean it. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Um, you guys have a fantastic Our day. pleasure. Thank you Thank for you. talking to us. Bye, Iron Thank Man. Thank you.